Today we're going to make one of my favorite dishes of all time, crispy fried artichokes. You're not going to want to miss this. Okay, often the most delicious ingredients are the most simple ingredients, artichokes and lemons and oil. That's all we need. So get a bowl of lemon water that prevents your artichokes from turning brown. And then now we're going to just clean our artichokes. I have small artichokes, which I recommend. Even smaller than that is easy to prepare. Large artichokes are a little bit more challenging. So just get a small to medium one. So I removed the outer leaves. The green part is always going to be not delicious. And the white and yellow part is going to be very delicious. So use a peeler after you remove those outer leaves and just peel down that stem until it's nice and white. So you remove those outer leaves until you see a lot of yellow, probably like three quarters yellow on those larger leaves. And that's exactly what you want. So just peel away that green, make sure you just have white and yellow showing. And we're going to cut the tip of the stem off and we're going to cut the tips of the leaves off because that's dark green. That's not going to taste good. And the beauty of having a small artichoke is there's no fuzzy choke inside. If you have a fuzzy choke, you're going to need to scoop it out with a spoon. I did not show that in this video because I just bought small artichokes and that's what I recommend. It's very important after each step of cleaning your artichoke, dip them in lemon water so they don't turn brown. Grab yourself some oil. Olive oil works best. Pomace oil works very well, which is like second or third pressed olive oil. Or you can use a canola olive mix. And we're going to fry these artichokes twice. So we're going to fry them once at 280 until they're soft, tender, and light golden brown. And then we're going to fry them again really, really hot. So for the first fry, that's exactly what you're looking for. The stem is tender and the leaves are just starting to turn brown. So after this step, you can keep them in the refrigerator for up to a couple days, but I'm going to fry them right away. So what you're going to want to do is put them on a rack, let them drain, let them cool, and you're going to open the leaves so it looks like a flower, like the little petals of a flower. So it looks nice and beautiful. So just use your thumbs, peel them open. And in the meantime, heat your oil up to 350. And we're going to give these babies a hot bath in that beautiful oil. So once your oil's 350, those petals are open, throw it in the oil, let it fry for about three to five minutes until they're really dark and crispy. And then you're going to see that they look perfect and golden brown. So don't think that you went too dark. They're supposed to be pretty dark like that. Okay. You don't want them black, but you want them dark brown like that season with salt right away. Let them cool, chop a little parsley because you need a little beautiful green color on top of those artichokes and put them in whatever dish you want to. I'm lining with a little piece of butcher paper because I think it looks a little nicer and I'm doing three artichokes per dish. And I'm just going to hit it with a little parsley, a little slice of lemon, and that's all it takes to make those beautiful Roman Jewish style fried artichokes. I hope you guys love this video. If you did hit that thumbs up, hit that like button, stay tuned for lots of videos coming in the future. And thank you so much for watching. Have a terrific day.